Welcome to News in Brief from RJ at Global Network. Daily meetings of the Grand Ayatollah Shirazi. The Grand Shia Islamic Jurist Ayatollah Sayyid Sadak Shirazi holds in person meetings with large numbers of people, including religious scholars, university figures, and social and cultural activists, as well as public groups of people on a daily basis. In these meetings, the attendees report on their activities, explain their views, and listen to the guidelines and advices of the Grand Jurist. Representative of Gwanda Ayatollah Sistani meets Gwanda Ayatollah Shubazi. Sayyid Shahrastani, the representative and deputy of the Gwanda Ayatollah Sistani, along with an entourage, met with the Gwan Shia jurist Ayatollah Sayyid Sadak Shubazi at the Gwan Jurist Center while office in Holikom, Iran. In this meeting, the latest religious and social topics regarding the Shia Muslims were discussed. Meetings of Sayyid Hussein Shubazi in Kuwait. With the beginning of Ramadan, Sayyid Hussein Shubazi, the son of the Grand Jurist Ayatollah Sayyid Sadak Shubazi, traveled to Kuwait in order to hold talks with religious and political figures of Kuwait. In the past few days, the Grand Jurist son visited several religious and community centers in this country. Sayyid Hussein Shubazi, along with a number of scholars and intellectuals, talked about the religious and political life conditions of the Shia Muslims in this country during his visits to the famous Shia halls. Some of the halls visited by the Grand Jurist son are as follows. The Hall of late Haj Hussein Bahbahani, the Hall of Haji Jawad Bukhamsin, the Hall of Haji Abdul Hussein Bahman and Haji Zaid Kaldami. Later on, Sayyid Hussein Shubazi settled in the Hall of Gwanda Ayatollah Shubazi to host his visitors. Office of Gwanda Ayatollah Shubazi in Karbala hosts juridical and ideological discussions during Ramadan. To make the most of this blissful month, the Office of the Gwanda Ayatollah Shubazi in Holy Karbala organized series of scientific discussions over juridical and ideological topics on every night of the holy month of Ramadan. These discussions are attended by the scholars from the Islamic Seminary of Holy Karbala, the seminary students and the intellectuals. In previous nights, the main topics of these discussions included the legitimate ways of citing the question of Ramadan, the legitimacy of citing the crescent with assisted vision or naked eye, the difference of time zones, and so on and so forth. These discussions will cover more topics on different fields of Islamic sciences by the end of Holy Ramadan. Shia Rights Watch publishes monthly report. In its latest monthly report, Shia Rights Watch uncovered the latest anti-Shia movement since April 25 to May 25, 2017. This report highlights the most blatant terrorist operations against Shias and the violation of Shias' religious and human rights in countries in different countries of the world. This report will be handed over to the Human Rights Foundations, the media and the public opinion. It is not worthy that Shia Rights Watch headquartered in Washington DC is affiliated to the office of the Gwanda Ayatollah Shirazi. Food packages distributed among needy families. With the arrival of the Holy Ramadan and following the orders of the Grand Ayatollah Shuazi about helping the needy and the poor, the 14 infallible institute in Holy Kabbalah distributed financial helps and food packages among the needy families, the orphans and the families of the Iraqi mothers.